Warriors to another color class comparison, which I'm actually using a little bit as a style comparison as well today, because we've got three Belle Tress beauties here, and all three of these Belle Tress colors are blondes that are not rooted. Um, there are also three styles that I thought would actually be really interesting to look at side by side as well. So hopefully this has got a double uh, interest for people who are watching today. So let me explain to you what we've got. First of all, on this side, we've got Bon Bon by Beltress, and this color is Vanilla Lush. The one in the center here, we're looking at City Roast by Beltress, and the color here is Cream Soda Blonde. And over here on the end, we've got Lemonade by Beltress, and the color that you're looking at is Coconut Silver Blonde. So I figure with these three, you can kind of see the differences straight away. Um, I've tried to put them sort of from cooler to warmer um, to make it a bit easier. So the cooler one is definitely over here. This is the Coconut Silver Blonde. This one is Lemonade. Then you've got um, Cream Soda Blonde here on City Roast. And you can see with this one, she's starting to have those um, cooler elements from Coconut Silver Blonde. But we've also got some of these warmer highlights coming in over the top. And then once you get over here to Bon Bon, this is Vanilla Lush. This is an, uh, a one of the older style colors that they've got at Beltress, which is one of their classic colors, and it is very much a warm color. Now, hopefully turning them around to the back will actually make it a lot clearer as well. So once we start to look over here at the Coconut Silver Blonde, you'll see that it is quite a cool color. Now, I have a cool color on the um, white that I'm using here. Um, but if you're looking for a cool, unrooted blonde in this range um, from Beltress, then the Coconut Silver Blonde is a really good choice. It's such a beautiful colour. Just turn it around back here. So if you're a cool blonde wearer, that's going to be a great choice for you. This one, Cream Soda Blonde, this is on City Roast. You can see here that she's got that cool colour, but you're starting to see these highlights coming through in here of this warmer colour. Okay, so it definitely, when you pull it um, back to an overall appearance, this is a great one if you might have a neutral um, complexion and you're looking for a colour that's not really cool, but also not really warm. You want something that's in the middle, yeah? This one would be a really great one for that. Again, it's not rooted um, and it's just a really nice sort of midpoint colour. This one over here, the Bon Bon in the Vanilla Lush, Vanilla Lush, yeah, that is definitely a warm colour and we're pushing into like a, a sort of a ginger colour here not the ginger that they call the Beltress colour that is a brown okay but like a traditional sort of reddish colour with this blonde over the top so it's got a lot more of that red in it you know? really warms this colour up it's a fantastically warm colour now also putting them side by side you can start to see the differences in these styles okay so you're looking at lemonade over here she's kind of got a bit more of a messy look about her with the waves that are coming down here she's a little bit longer than city roast and can you see underneath with city roast she's straight okay so you've got this curl over the top with city roast and then that straightness underneath which we don't have really have here over here with bon bon she's the longest probably the fullest because you're not having as many layers really it's coming down to a much more even kind of length there are layers here but it's it's a different kind of profile to the other two even though they've all got those waves in them um, the cuts here I think are what the difference is now if you turn these colors and styles onto the sides you'll really start to see the difference with these styles okay so this is the Bon Bon and this is the lemonade you're kind of getting a little bit closer here Okay, but this with the City Roast, look at that, that's a lot longer at the front than it is at the back, okay, comes up. These ones are not, these ones are a lot straighter, okay. And now if you're looking at these from the front, then you're going to see differences in the styles again. This one, which is Bon Bon, you've got slightly shorter at the front and then it goes to basically the same length around here. Again, you can see that longer style here with City Rose, she's longer at the front, shorter at the back. This one is a little bit different because with Lemonade, she's a little bit longer here and then she's slightly longer at the front. Not by a huge amount, but enough. You see that? Now you can see them together. You can see those differences. Some of these differences are really subtle, right? Like I would say, if I was say a regular um, Bon Bon wearer and I couldn't get Bon Bon in the color I wanted, I could probably go for this one quite happily you know it's a slightly different angle but 
they're quite similar. Whereas City Roast, I feel like she's quite unique. Um, she reminds me a little bit of uh, Ryan or Preston by Aesthetica Designs. Preston very much with this at the back with this curl and Ryan because of this coming down to the side here. Um, but you know, they're, they're three really lovely styles and as you can see from these colours, um, it's really nice that um, Beltress are bringing out these non-rooted blonde colours to go with um, Vanilla Lush because she used to be pretty much the only blonde that you could get which was um, a non-rooted blonde. Now we're getting these great options, which is fantastic if you're looking for a non-rooted blonde in a Beltre style. So there you go. I hope this has been helpful. This is Bon Bon in Vanilla Lush by Beltre. This is City Roast in Cream Soda Blonde. And this one here is Lemonade in Coconut Silver Blonde. Three beautiful styles and three lovely non-rooted blondes. My name's Kat. I'm from Wig Warrior. You can find all three of these lovely ladies at our website www.wigwarrior.com.au Make sure you subscribe so you can see our comparisons as they come up and any of our reviews and uh, look forward to seeing you soon. Till then, have a great day. Bye.